Hey, what's going on guys and welcome to yet another one of my tutorials. Uh, in today's tutorial, uh, I'll be pretty much going over with you on how to install the most pickiest doggone emulator the world has ever seen to date. Uh, it is uh, the main emulator. Uh, if you find any ROMs guys that work with this emulator, consider yourself lucky because <laughs> there's a handful that do not work. I don't know why, I don't know. They make so many different ROMs, it seems like, to go with like maybe like a MAME on the computer, the MAME on the Wii, the PSP, or whatever. The certain ROMs work with certain MAME emulators. This crazy, really is. But I'm going to show you what I have, and uh, I'm going to go over with you on how to install it and all this good stuff. Unfortunately, uh, I haven't got it to work with the, uh, for, you know, to load games up off the USB. I don't think you can do that. I've tried over and over again, it just won't do it. But, uh, it, yeah, they were only loaded up from the SD card. So, let's go ahead and get started. We'll hop over to the computer, guys, and I'll show you, show you what's going on here. Okay? Okay. Okay, guys. Uh, so, let's just go ahead and jump right into this. Um, what I got here, uh, this is where you're going to download your uh, name uh, emulator right here. Uh, you got your download button over here. Um, download that uh, just download the, the latest version um, main ROMs uh, I've I've archived all the ROMs that I have uh, and upload them to a media fire site if y'all want to if y'all want to check them out you can it's, uh, it's about two and a half gigs here uh, it's quite a few of them guys quite a few you can go through them and find out which ones work and which don't uh, all I know is uh, I've downloaded some before a lot of them and absolutely none of them showed up I don't know. Uh, this set that I downloaded, uh, kind of mixed them up a little bit, but all of them seem to have showed up, but I haven't tested all of them out to, to see exactly which ones work and which ones don't. So uh, I'll, be, uh, I'll let you guys um, go through them, and as I work around this MAME, you know, and uh, play around with it, I'll find out which ones do work and which ones don't for me. But, this is where you can uh, download some ROM sets. Um, there's one site I went to and it was a total of like 50 gigs. So there's a lot of them out there guys. Uh, and this is what bothers me is uh, <laughs> you have your MAME 161.37b5, uh, your MAME 2003 reference set. I mean there's so many different kinds. I mean which ones are we supposed to use on <laughs> which emulators or whatever. I don't know. I, I couldn't even tell you. Uh, I don't know where I got mine from. Like I said, I was just downloading different ones, you know, different games from all over the place here and there, you know. So I have no idea what I got in my set. Um, but that's that. I've already got it downloaded, guys. And uh, here it is up here. Really simple. Straightforward, guys. Really, it is. Um, okay, so here's my SD card. And... It's like all my other videos, if you don't have this apps folder, just simply drag and drop it to the root of your SD card here. Um, if you do, just take the contents of that apps folder and just drag and drop this right inside your apps folder on your SD card. Okay? Simple as that. Uh, your MAME right here, uh, like I said, uh, they can only be booted up from your SD card. Uh, they wouldn't work for me on the USB so just drag and drop this folder here onto your, the root of your SD card guys because this is where all your ROMs gonna go here all right so that's that and that's that's it guys I mean that is absolutely it of the computer portion of this tutorial I mean just simply dragging two folders over uh, put, placing your games inside there and the ROMs folder here and that's it so let's just go over to the uh, Wii now and we'll see what we can get working and what we can't. All right, I'll meet you over there. Okay, so here's our main channel right here. Do it. Pretty cool channel. Sounds pretty cool. Okay, 
Let's get right into this, shall we? Alright, so I use the uh, GameCube controller with this. I think that's all you can use, I'm not sure. Yeah, because my Wii, my Wii remote just, no, it come back on. So, I, I use the GameCube controller. Uh, there's a few games that I wanted to show you. Um, these are all my games here. I got I got a lot of them, guys, that finally I got to show up here. So, this, these are it. Um, I'm using the uh, right trigger button to uh, skim through all these games really quick like this. Um, there it is, Contra. It's one of my favorite ones on here. Okay, so it's uh, please deposit coin. Oh, uh, I use the Z button. If you hit the Z button on your GameCube controller, that will actually insert a coin and you hit the start button. And so this is it right here, guys. Um, when you first get into this game, uh, the buttons will be backwards, guys. Um, I'll show you on the next game how to change the button. Uh, it, it'd be the same on every game though. But yeah, that, that's Contra. Uh, really, really fun game. Uh, as well as on the NES and all that good stuff. But how do you change the game? Uh, you take your Wii Remote, hit the home button. And then you'll scroll down to select new game and hit your number two button on your Wii Remote and then you can just skim through all your games again. But the current game will still be running in the background, but you know. Uh, the next game I was going to show you, let's see, uh oh, oh man. Hold on guys, let me start back over. I hit the wrong button here. Alright, um... Alright, we're gonna go with Dangerous Seed. That's one of my favorite games on the Sega. Alright, so we're gonna hit the Z button. Uh oh, I'm gonna wait until this... Okay, hit start on this bad boy. Okay, so the first thing that I noticed is my controller is not working the way it should. Uh, I can only move left and right, and my A button is to shoot, which I always like the B button to shoot, and my A button or whatever to use my special weapon. So, what we're gonna do, we're gonna change that, and uh, go to your Wii remote, hit your home button, go to input this game, hit your A button. That'll bring up all your uh, control mapping uh, options here. Uh, this right here, up, down, left, and right, right here we wanna set up. Uh, you just hit your A button and you hit up on your uh, D-pad or your analog stick, whatever you wanna do. I go with analog, uh, go down here, to P1 down, uh, hit your A button to select it, and you just hit down whatever button you want to uh, map to that particular uh, option. All right, um, left, hit your A button, hit left, oop, 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 hit left. Oh man, what's this crap? Go left again. All right, there we go. All right, A button, hit right, okay. And now you got button one, two, and three. Uh, we're gonna go with buttons one and two. So uh, you see where it says A and B? Those were backwards. So I want B where it's A at, and I want B, uh, A where B's at. So I'm gonna hit the A button, hit the B right here. Hit the A button and hit A button for that. And just hit your A button to return to the menu. And hit your, go down to return game, hit the A button. And uh, we're gonna try it again, see what happens. All 
Alright, so uh, I can move. I can move all around now. I'm free to do whatever the heck I want to do. My B button is shooting right now. Uh, my A button is a special weapon. So, it's all good. I got it. I got it. Doing what it's what I want it to do here. So, uh, I can probably beat it now. Uh, I doubt it. But, anyway. Uh, go to go to the Wii mode again. Uh, we're going to go down to select a new game here. And this time, uh, let's try... There's just another cool game called Darius. Really awesome. Uh oh. Yeah, right here. Just hit your A button to select it. And I got a code dump. Okay. I didn't get that last time, but we will start it over really quick. So yeah guys, if you if you come across that, just just I guess you just want to start it over because it, it it does that sometimes. It's crazy. We're finicky, <laughs> I guess. Okay, try it again. We'll go down to Darius. Okay, here we go, and we'll hit the A button. Okay, now we're all good to go here. I'm gonna go ahead and hit the Z button. Okay, so here's our game. And again, uh, my buttons are backwards. I cannot go up and down. Um, I can only go forward and back, and my B button is to shoot the missiles, and my A button is to actually shoot, shoot the uh, regular gun here. So that's not what I want. So I'm gonna go hit the uh, home button so to input this game. And again, see these are not set right, right here. So we're just gonna go set them, hit the A button up. Uh, A button down. A button left. A button right. And these right here were backwards, so I'm gonna go with, uh, I'm gonna choose this as the B button where the A button's at right now. So B button, A button. Okay. All right. Cool, man. Uh oh, and I just hit the dog on top of the. I love the game, but I suck at it. Yeah, as you can see. But yeah, it, 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 it's all working fine now, guys. Uh, no biggie. Um, it's doing exactly what I what I wanted it to do. Ugh. Okay. So that's main for you guys. It, uh, only a handful of games actually work that I can see. Uh, and some of them you go into. I mean, you get a code dump. I heard it used a lot of CPUs, so that could be the reason why it code dumps a lot or something. Uh, I don't know. Oh my gosh. But anyway, that's it, guys. I suck at name. But uh, <laughs> that's it. And I hope maybe I have went over something that y'all didn't know, uh, hopefully. Um, and so that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. And uh, if you have any suggestions on any tutorials that I could do uh, just let me know and I'll let you know if I'll be able to do them uh, I actually wanted to do the Neo Geo but I cannot do that right now because my Wii remote here cuts off and I can't I can't go get into my games or anything uh, it works with the Neo Geo CD but not the Neo Geo regular Neo Geo but anyway that's it guys uh, this is Bobby signing out and I'll see y'all next time on either a let's play or another tutorial y'all have a good one